Hey everyone, Mark here from Snap Wireless. Today I would like to walk you through our new and improved 3-in-1 wireless charger, the Powerbase 2.0. Our Powerbase 2.0 is available in both black and white. Today I'll be unboxing the white. Upon receiving and unboxing the Powerbase, this is what you will find. When you remove the lid, you will see our beautiful and minimalistic Powerbase. We designed the Powerbase to be super sleek and stylish to suit any home or office. The Powerbase is super thin and has a soft anti-slip rubber oil finish on the top. On the bottom, there are four rubber spots that allows it to not slip on any flat surface. Also in the box, you will find a user manual, a Type-C cable to power the device, as well as a silicon pad, which I'll show you how to use in a minute. Packaged separately is an Apple Watch stand or a Samsung Watch stand, depending on the Powerbase model you have purchased. Keep in mind the Powerbase does not include an Apple Watch charger or a Samsung Watch charger. You will need to install your own. I'll start off with setting up the Apple Watch stand. The first step is to slide the back casing off of the power base. On the inside, you will see some rigid areas where the Apple Watch charger will fit into. The next step is to take the Apple Watch stand and feed the USB end of your watch charger through the top of the stand. Just pull the cable through until the head of the charger mounts in securely like so. On the back, you will see some small grooves where you can click the watch charger into place to give a smooth and minimalistic finish. The next step is to take the USB end of the charger and feed it through the circular cutout of the power base. Once you feed it through, you just mount the charger in like so. Once the Apple Watch stand is attached, just flip it over. You will have to wrap the Apple Watch cable around the power base. You'll need to wrap it anti-clockwise and it will wrap around twice. Once it's wrapped around, you just have to plug it into the USB port on the bottom of the power base and then simply attach the back casing. You may have also noticed there was a small gap on the bottom of the power base. This is where you can use the silicon pad to fill in the space. Now for everyone that has purchased the Samsung Watch power base, the setup is essentially the same except for one step, which is the direction you have to wrap the cable around the power base, which I'll show you how to set up now. Once the Samsung Watch charger is attached to the stand and the stand is attached to the power base, just flip it over and you'll have to wrap the cable around clockwise, unlike the Apple Watch, which was anti-clockwise. When you get to this section, you will have to do a figure eight style pattern using the grooves in the power base. Then instead of the Apple Watch charger, which wrapped around twice, you will only have to wrap this around once. Once it's wrapped around, simply plug it into the USB port of the power base. And then you can attach the back casing on, just like so. Now that your Apple Watch charger is all set up, you just have to plug it into power. You have to make sure you're using either a quick charge plug or a PD plug that delivers up to 18 watts of power. If you don't have one, that's fine, you can just purchase one of ours. Using the USB-C cable included, take the USB-C end and plug it into the back of the power base, and then take the USB-A end and plug this into the quick charge adapter, which will then plug into power. You will see the LED indicators light up, which means you're ready to start charging. And this is where our Powerbase 2.0 truly differs from our first generation Powerbase. We've incorporated two magnetic rings inside the Powerbase, so your phone will just snap into the perfect charging position every time. The Powerbase 2.0 is MagSafe compatible with all iPhone 12 models. If you don't have an iPhone 12, but you still want your phone to snap into place perfectly every time, we've given you two options. The first option is you could purchase one of our SnapMag magnetic rings, which can attach to the back of your phone or phone case. Alternatively, you can purchase our SnapMag leather case, which has a magnetic ring built inside. Once you're all set up with either your SnapMag leather case or SnapMag ring, you will no longer need to mess around with your charger trying to find the perfect position to charge. Once you're all set up, you can charge all of your devices in one single place from one single cable, and your phone will just snap into place. Thanks very much for watching our setup and tutorial of our Powerbase 2.0. If you have any other questions, feel free to reach out to us on our help center on our website.